Sure are a lot of lights and switches up here. Clear on my side. Hey, Dirt. We got a location on the cartel's primary training camp here in Montioc. Let's hit it. Activity, stay sharp. Hola, amigo. You hear anything about the cartel around here? Where they are, or things like that? Gracias. I have a location on a cartel comm center here in Montioc. This could be the break we're looking for. How do you figure? We get in there, hack the message logs, and feed the intel to Bowman. With any luck, she can scrub the records and come up with an ID on our mystery instructor. I got eyes on a weapons case. Looks like we've riled them up. I'm opening fire on these shitheads. This will go nice with my boots. Let's 
fired on the cartel. Frag out. Santa Blanca's foreign military instructors are working out of the program's main training camp in Montaillac. We've got a problem. Killing them will bring training here. in the province to a halt. Looks like some sort of cartel training camp. According to Bowman, all of the new recruits come through here. Santa Blanca hires ex-military guys as trainers, not just Mexicans either. Some of them come from Russia, Africa, Israel, even had a couple come from the U.S. What's got to happen in your life to decide working for a drug cartel is a viable career move? Nothing good. Watch it, it's gonna blow. Coming up on the objective area. Get in there, find the instructors, and take them out. Frag out. Okay. Looks like they're settling down over there. Engaging Tango. Frag out. Come me up that culero. We got enemy reinforcements incoming. <laughs> Demo is timed and in play. So long. Demo's primed. Put this to use.
Hit the dirt. Helicopter. Hold on, man. I'll be right there. Next to the container. I got get some. Got one of those cartel medals here. Some Sicario is gonna miss this. I've got the location of a cartel medal they're planning on giving to some Billy badass. They're just chasing the fucking tails now. That's the last of the instructors. We're done here. You really think this will slow the cartel down? Absolutely. When word gets out about what happened, El Miro is going to have a hell of a time getting new instructors. And if the dumbasses don't listen, we keep coming back until they get the message. Instructors hit. Good kill. <sighs> Ahorita 
Hey, I found details on an SB supply helicopter. All we have to do is hijack it and deliver it to the rebels. Simple, right? I asked the rebels to recon this area. We copy. We lay in enemy positions now. I called for some rebels to back us up. Copy that. We have men on the way. I put a call to the rebels for a diversion. Copy. Help us en route to that position. We've located the stocks of ammo and mortar shells being used for training in Montreal. Destroying the stocks will bring training in the province to a halt. We got a chopper. Ready? Fire, fire, fire. A copy. Escort vehicle is destroyed. Shot down the helo. Convoy has a non-armored vehicle along to the right. for rebels to draw their attention. Opening fire. He's gone. Okay, we're still all right. Ah, there's a care package that came in by airdrop, and here's the location. We should check it out.
alert. I'm shooting these fuckers. up on the objective now. Weapons free. If it looks like a supply crate... Hold on. up on the objective now. Weapons free. If it looks like a supply crate, take it out. Wait. Frag out. Weapons crate destroyed.
Cartel Sicario. to the crates. Objective's clear. You think it'll help? Shit, the way I see it, the less these assholes have to shoot at me with, the better. Got that right. We've got a location on a Santa Blanca communications... Hola, compañero. Buckle up, people. I'm in. Let's go. Holy crap! up on the objective now. We need to get inside and hack their message logs for intel. Let's move. Fucker knows somebody's gunning for him now. Frag out. Come mierda, culeros. Taking a shot. Target down. Frag out. Get some. Downloading now. I'm pushing the take direct to Bowman. Stand by. Bowman, this is Nomad. I'm sending you message logs from a cartel comm center here in Montauk. 
If we're lucky, the name of the cartel's senior instructor is in there. I'm getting it now. Wait one. No joy. There's nothing in here that points to their top guy. There is something interesting. I'm back. Sorry about the interruption. No worries. Let's make this quick. No joy. There's nothing in here that points to their top guy. There is something interesting, though. Looks like they've got search parties out looking for a deserter. One of their new recruits ran off a few days back. They think he might still be in the area. How does that help us? If he was in the training program for any length of time, it's possible he came into contact with our guy. You think this deserter can give us an ID? Only one way to find out. Grenade, get to cover. Thanks. We've picked up chatter that the cartel's looking for a deserter up in the hills. Find this guy and bring him in. He Good can tell go. us a lot about the cartel's training program. Fire, fire, fire! The lieutenant's trying to escape. Made us get after him. Man down, just hold on to your shit. Man down. Guys, ready? Fire. Roger that. Talk to me, pinche pendejo. Who's this deserter you're looking for? Some little pocos huevos maricón de mierda who ran off from the training camp. Boss says we get to make an example out of him so the others don't get the same idea. We're gonna drag him back and let the other recruits take turns on him with a machete. 
Where is this little chicken shit now? We don't know for sure yet, but we're getting close. One of the other search parties thinks they found his trail. Where's this other search party? Tell me and maybe I'll let you go. Okay, okay, Jinga. Long. We're closing in on the deserter. Let's sweep the area where he was spotted and see if we can find him. Got tangos, danger close. Got eyes on another search party. We gotta be in the right grid. Cartel's closing in. We'd best haul ass and find this dude before they do. Copy that. Damn, that sure got his attention. Sniper, get down! Opening fire on these fuckers. <laughs> Got eyes on the package. Go, go, go. A copy. activity nearby. Got eyes on another search party. We gotta be in the right grid. Cartel's closing in. We'd best haul ass and find this dude before they do. Copy that. I'm moving to position. Got another tango. Target acquired. Standing by. I'm shooting these fuckers. Got eyes on the package. Go, go, go. Quítate, pendejo. Back the Quítate fuck up. Quieto. Put the mic. Get the fuck away from me. Let me go. Shut up. From here on out, I talk. You listen. Not if you understand. Now move. <gasps> I'll drive. 
we are out. I'll meet you there. You want to get away from the cartel, Emilio? I can make that happen. But I need something from you. What can you tell me about the man running the camp? Carajo? I don't know. He's a gringo. Big man. Got eyes like stones, you know? It's malo. Even the guards are scared of him. He got a name? One of the instructors, they call him Bookhart. Carl Bookhart? You know who he's talking about? There was a Sergeant Bookhart with the Rangers when I was in the sandbox back in 03. We worked together a couple of times. Shit. Get back to your team. I'll check in with Langley and see what I can find out about Bookhart. Emilio gave us a name. Carl Bookhart. Dude's an American? If he's the guy I'm thinking of. He used to be an army ranger. We even served together. Together for a while. A ranger? No. No fucking way. Bowman's getting confirmation now. She'll get back to us when she knows for sure. Got some background for you on Carl Bookhart. Looks like you were right. His 214 has him in Iraq with 3rd Battalion, 75th Ranger Regiment back in 03, discharged in 06, and then he drops off the radar. I'm getting the notion he's kept in shape. Our deserter tells me he's at a cartel base located inside the abandoned Chosa Padre silver mine. Find Bookhart, take him out. Killing him will disrupt the cartel's training program for months. Copy that, we'll get it done. We've got a positive ID on the cartel senior instructor, a former army ranger named... Get ready. Odds left, evens right. Focus on your goddamn sectors this time. Carl Bookhart, former sergeant, 3rd Battalion, 75th Ranger Regiment, natural born killer. Show me what you got, cocksuckers. Make me hard. Go, go, go! Carl was in and out of juvie from around age 15. Records are sealed, but the pattern is what you'd expect. At 18, a judge gave him the choice of joining the army or doing jail time. Bookhart thrived in the army. After graduating from Ranger School, he deployed to Iraq with 3rd Battalion in 2003. He finally found his place and was looking to make the army his career. And then in 05, his patrol hit an IED in downtown Ramadi. Bookhart didn't take to civilian life. Couldn't keep a job for more than a couple weeks and started having run-ins with the cops again. Started telling anyone who'd listen about how the army fucked him over. Eventually, he started spending time over the border in Juarez. God knows what Bukhar was looking for down there, but eventually he crossed paths with El Muro, head of Santa Blanca security. They share some beers, maybe some blow. 
Bukhar gets to talking about his army days, Amuro is impressed. He knows the real thing when he sees it. He asks Bukhar to come to Bolivia to train the cartel's army in the Montilla province. Amuro wants them to be the best force of its kind in all of South America. And Bukhar is just the kind of man he's looking for. The kind of man who can run combat drills, show a bunch of morons how to field strip a G36 in two minutes flat. The kind of man who can turn narcos into elite soldiers. company stay sharp we're closing in on bookhart's last known location we really gonna do this boss kill one of our own bookhart stopped being our brother the day he went to work for the cartel you see him you take him out no hesitation they're gonna see you hold up Jesus, it smells like a slaughterhouse in here. The hell kind of training is Bookhart doing? The first thing a Sicario recruit learns is what it's like to kill a human being. They bring in prisoners and make the recruits take turns on them with hammers and machetes. Sometimes it's men, sometimes women, sometimes it's little kids. And the recruits know that if they hesitate, they're next. I got a target carrying submachine guns. Just spotted one with submachine guns. We're good, we're good. Sicario over here in the firing post. I've been wanting one of these. Got a target carrying submachine guns. Just spotted one with submachine guns. They're gonna spot you. <laughs> 
You're done. Grenade, move, move, move! Good work in Montaoc. Losing Bookhart's gonna have a major impact on the cartel's training program. Santa Blanca's best troops are gonna be stretched thin to try and cover for the loss. It'll compromise their security and get us one step closer to El Muro. Damn right. The cartel's been calling the shots in Bolivia for years. Now, finally, we're starting to push back. Keep at it. El Muro was outmanned and outgunned, and he knew it. What do you do when you don't have an army and you need one? You buy one. Every officer, like every prostitute, has a price. Give it an el sueño. It was the right move. I would have done the same thing. But El Muro forgot. Fear is always worth more than money. We got him. Bookhart's dead. Hell of a way for a ranger to die. Bookhart chose this. Don't forget that. We did what we had to do. I'll pilot. Thank you. 
I'll fly. You really only let me drive. Bowman, this is Nomad. We're in Kiwani province. What have you got for us? Kiwani's a major hub for the cartel's smuggling operations. We're talking about a sophisticated network of planes, trains, and cargo trucks carrying upwards of 30 tons of powder across the border. The network is the brainchild of an American national by the name of Boston Reed. Reed's a bush pilot who's been flying for Nydia Flores at El Buquita for years, and eventually worked his way into management. How do we get Reed? That's the tricky part. Reed's cagey as fuck. He stays in hiding most of the time, preferring to work through middlemen. Psych profile says he's clinically paranoid, but I think there's more to it than that. Like what? Money transfers that don't add up, message traffic to unknowns across the border, flights that don't correspond to cartel shipping routines. Reed's moving more than powder, and he doesn't want Sueño to know about it. We've been getting reports of cartel activity around the train cemetery for some time now. See what you can find out. We've got intel on cartel activity at the train cemetery. Check the place out and see what you can find. Nomad, I just uploaded Boston Reed's CIA profile video. Should help you track him down here in Kiwani. And Papa Reed raised little Boyer on apple pie and the Red Sox. Since graduating from high school, Boyer Boston Reed has done everything he could to shed that clean-cut image of his youth. Looking for adventure, Reed left his hometown of Lexington, Massachusetts, and became a bush pilot in South America. Medical records also tell a saga of gonorrhea, hep C, and herpes. As a pilot, he stayed clean for a number of years, but one fateful day, he met El Boquita. Within days, Reed was flying Santa Blanca's Coke to Georgia, Florida, and the Carolinas. With the drug smuggling came the money, and Reed loves to spend it. He's chummy with Bukita, who gave him that nickname Boston because of his accent. Make no mistake, Reed may play hard, but he works harder. Now based out of Kiwani, he coordinates all of Santa Blanca's smuggling by air. He uses temporary airstrips, and his own people don't know where they are until the last possible moment. When he's working, Boston Reed is impossible to locate. And you're gonna find him. train cemetery. That where old trains go to die. When the local mines went bust, the companies left all their trains behind. Keep your heads down. We don't want to say a big hello until we find something. Hold on. 
Signs of cartel activity up ahead. Looks like Bowman was right. What's the play, boss? Let's find the asshole in charge and see what he can tell us. is airborne. seeing two narcos here. Tell me where. Near that stack of tires. If that's a tour group, I'll eat my fucking boot. You think this is connected to Reed? Only one way to find out. What about the friendlies? We'll cut them loose if we can, but it's not our priority. Clear? Clear. Here's target, target number five. Copy. Target Marty to engage. <laughs> Opening fire on these fuckers. Got eyes on a Santa Blanca lieutenant. Looks like he may be the man we're looking for. Got it. Remember, we need him alive. Frag out. Try to take us off some sweet jumps, all right? Ready. Call the shot. Easy. Ave Maria Purissima. We're cool. We're cool. Take it easy, okay? Calma, te pues. Let's talk about this. Maybe we can make a deal. You want a deal? How's this? Give me Reed, and maybe I don't blow your brains out. I want, I want to look. I don't know where he is, okay? He does everything to his middle. What about these people? Where are they from? Five or six villages Reed likes to hate. Places where people disappear, and no one asks any questions. I see this. And the cartel, they get a cut too. No, no, no. We keep this to ourselves. Sueño would send every one of us to El Pozolero. I want a list of these villages you've been targeting. Now. Tranquis, okay? Whatever you say. But you didn't get it from me, all right? Ta claro? Roman, you were right about Reed. Fuckers running a human trafficking operation right under Sueño's nose. Outstanding. This could be the level we need to force Reed into the open. Keep pulling on that thread, Nomad. Let's see where it leads. What about the cocaine smuggling network? No reason why you can't investigate that too. Reed's at the center of both. With luck, we can kill two birds with one stone. Copy that. No, but... Hold on. Engage targets. Fuck, fuck, fuck! We got cartel Sicario troops engaging us.
Hey, we got a narco. By the camp entrance. According to this, the cartel's got a supply plane loaded at a local airstrip. Might be weapons and ammo, might be medicine. Whatever it is, if the cartel could use it, the rebels could too. Sounds like an invitation. schedule for one of the air traffic controllers at the Kiwani airport. It just so happens that this guy's always on duty when the cartel's got a flight planned. What a coincidence. Let's track this guy down and see what he knows about Reed. Army units in the area. Ya están por llegar los refuerzos. Eliminen a esa gente de inmediato. I'm good. Crank it. shooting these fuckers. Bowman, we got intel on a truck depot in Kiwani that coordinates all the shipments moving through the province. Bravo, Zulu. That's just what we need. What's the play? You want us to shut it down? No, we take out the depot, they'll just relocate somewhere else and we won't be any closer to figuring out the rest of the pipeline. The keys to the whole Kiwani smuggling network. We've got intel on an air traffic control. are in that depot. Routes, destinations, cargo manifest, the works. We need to sneak into the depot and copy their files. Then we'll have everything we need. We? I'm with you in spirit. That counts, right?
eyes on a bunch of Sicarios. Okay, we're still good. Over there, next to the container. Back it up, they're gonna see you. Grandma, que fue eso, cabrón? Holding fire on these shitheads. God damn it. Shit off. Right out. Cover. LT's trying to run. Shit, we got a sniper. Grenade, move. Grenade, move, move, move. Rebels to drop. That was close. Eyes on the ATC. Let's move in. Kid, yes, Kupa, kid. Leave me alone. Por favor, ¿qué quiere? Is de Santa Blanca? Unidad? What do you want? We know you work with Boston Reed. Don't bother denying it. It'll just get you hurt. Está bien, está bien. Whatever you say. I want to know about his movements. Where does he go the most? En media luna, pues. East of here, due east. There's an airstrip in the bush he makes deliveries to. When the jefe Reed needs to meet a buyer, he has me send a code over to the network to a buyer in Media Luna. The buyer meets him at the airstrip to collect the shipment. Give me that code, then show me the computer you use to send it. Está bien, está bien. It's right here. El reporte indica que no hay signos del enemigo. Los rebeldes se retiraron.
Chopper's approaching. Code sent. Now we need to get to that airstrip. We gonna rock all the way to Media Luna, boss? I had another plan in mind. One of those crates outside ought to be fueled up. Smart. Reed's men won't shoot one of their own, and the buyer won't see us coming. Who's up to date on their flight reviews? Fuck, they're coming right at us. You got no idea what I'm capable of. Chill the fuck out, Way. I'm talking, all right? Call to the rebels for a diversion. Sure are a lot of lights and switches up here. Here. 
enemy activity. Stay sharp. We got a couple of grunts here. There, by the container. Let's go. Move out. I'm on your six. Just hit a civilian. The buyer's on the move. Get after him. Got eyes in the buyer. Careful who you shoot. Wait. Chichi, marche. Got eyes in the buyer. Careful who you shoot. We still need that. Pero por favor, por favor, no me lastime. I'm just a businessman. Boston Reed, where is he? I don't know where he is, okay? Everything goes through his middleman. I make an order and he delivers it. That's it. An order for what? People, okay? Men? Women? Who know? What happens to these people you buy? Depends. Most of the girls end up as sex slaves. The men get put to work. Some just get cut up and used for their organs. You know how much a young kidney's worth? You pay in cash? Usually, yeah. Fucking suitcases for. Usually? Last time I came up short, it was a rush order, and I didn't have enough money on hand. Had to wire the rest to one of Reed's bank accounts. Motherfucker was pissed. But what else could I do? I want the name of the bank and the account number. Sure, yeah. I I'll write it down, and then we're done here, right? You go your way and I go mine, right? Got eyes in the buyer. Careful who you shoot. We still need that scumbag alive. We're starting to put the pieces together. I'll upload the bank info to Bowman. Between that and the list of villagers targeted by Reed's people, she ought to be able to come up with some solid leads.
Bowman. I've been working on the intel you got from Kwani, and I think I've got a line on Reed. Let's hear it. I cross-referenced security camera footage at Reed's bank with suspected human traffickers operating around the villages you provided. Got two hits, brothers Carlos and Hernando Guerrero, a.k.a. Los Enteradores. The Undertakers? Nasty pieces of work. They specialize in snatching people right out of their beds. If half of what the locals say about them is true, they're a pair of fucking monsters. We're sure they're working for Reed. They withdrew funds from the bank account you gave me a couple of days ago. Where can I find these assholes? Triangulating off their cell phones now. Stand by for coordinates. Got a hit on Carlos's phone. I'm sending you his location now. You don't sound like that's a good thing. Carlos is the dumb one. It's his brother Hernando that most likely got info on Reed. We need to find Carlos. Follow him to his brother Hernando. Just be careful. If Carlos catches you following him, he'll find some way to warn Hernando. We'll never catch him then. Understood. He'll never know we're there. <laughs> Porque puedo volver a la cana y de ahí no, no salgo vivo. Me cuelan y luego me matan. 